Wow! Oh, hello everyone! Is it time for circle time? Oh, wonderful! Okay, I'm going to leave the imaginary world and head back into the circle time classroom. I'll see you there! Woo! Good morning. How are you? How are you, friends? My name is Miss Monica. What's your name? Oh, well, I'm so happy you came to circle time today. <gasps> Did you hear that? Listen, listen. Put on your listening ears. <laughs> I think I hear our good morning train coming. <laughs> the good morning train is coming. How are you? the classroom? Miss Monica, <laughs> I saw you floating. Oh, hi koala. Yes, I was. I was floating in space and it was so much fun. Miss Monica, oh. I learned oh. in February we celebrate and remember black people who made history. That's right. That's right. In February, we celebrate Black History Month. And that's why today we're going to learn about the very first African-American woman to travel into space. Wow. And guess what? We're even going to create our very own rocket ships. Oh, here's my very own rocket ship that I made. We're going to make our very own at the end of class. Oh, watch this, everyone. I think I can make it take off. One, two, three. Wow! <laughs> I can't wait. I'm feeling so excited about all we have to do today. How about we start by singing a song about feelings? Will you sing with me? Yay! Great. Come on. I have many feelings. Feelings are what I have. I have many feelings, feelings are what I have. I have many feelings, feelings are what I have. Sometimes I'm happy, sometimes I'm sad. Sometimes I'm silly, sometimes I'm mad. Sometimes I'm sleepy, sometimes surprised. When I'm scared of something, I close my eyes. All these emotions, they can make me cry. I have many feelings, feelings are what I have. I have many feelings, feelings are what I have. When I'm happy, I like to smile. When I'm sad, I make a frown. Sometimes I'm up, sometimes I'm down. When I'm silly, I laugh out loud. <laughs> now I know that feelings are what I have. I have 
many feelings, feelings are what I have. I have many feelings, please don't make me sad. I have many feelings, can you make me laugh? I have many feelings, feelings are what I have. And friends, how do you feel today? Oh, well thank you for sharing how you feel today. Today I'm feeling excited. I'm so excited because we have so much to do today. But it's time for us to review our circle time board. And now let's get our circle time card. Come on. Perfect. Everything we need. Oh, first I need to find my my pointer. Here it is, my circle time pointer. Now I can point to all of the different things on the board. Let's start with our days of the week. Are you ready? Do you have your pointers? Or use your pointer finger. Okay, remember when we sing days of the week, you can snap your fingers, one, two, or you can clap your hands, clap, clap. Get ready, get ready. Here we go. There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. One more time. There's Sunday. And friends, what day is it today for you? Oh, today is, oh, well, thank you for sharing what day it is. Let's go down our circle time board. Do, 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 do. The weather is, hmm, I think it's a great time to find out what's the weather. to go take a peek out your window and then come back and tell me what you see. I'll give you some time. <laughs> Are you back? <laughs> Great. What did you see? What's the weather where you are? Really? Well, thank you for sharing what the weather is where you are. I would like a turn too. I would like to share what the weather is here where the Circle Time classroom is. Oh, Bear Bear. Hi, Miss Monica. Hi, Bear Bear. Everyone wave to Bear Bear. Hi, friends. Bear Bear, will you help us with the weather today? Yes, I will, uh, Miss Monica. Bear Bear, what's the weather where you are? It's sunny and warm outside right now. Oh, it's a sunny day, and he said it's warm. Bear Bear, what are you going to wear on this warm, sunny day? I have on my Circle Time t-shirt and my hat. <gasps> Wonderful. Everyone, what color is Bear Bear's shirt? 
blue. Yes. And what color is Bear Bear's cap? Blue and yellow. Yes. Oh, thank you, Bear Bear, for helping us. See you soon. Bye. Bye, everyone. Now that we know it's a warm and sunny day, I think I have a sunny day picture to put on our board. Come on, let's go. Sunny day. Hmm. My friends, is this a sunny day picture? Ah. <laughs> no. This is a snowy day picture. Hmm. Let me try again. Is this a sunny day picture? Yay! Yes, it's a sunny day picture. Let's put it on the board. Here we go. Do, 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 do. And tap, tap, tap. Now we can read it. The weather is sunny. Let's read it again. Will you read it with me? Great. Here we go. The weather is sunny. Yes. Okay, let's keep going across our circle time board. Do, 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 do. Letter of the day. Hmm, what's our letter of the day? Let's take a look. P, that's right, letter P. Can you say P? Great, I think I have the letter P right here. Do, 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 do. P, letter P. This is uppercase P and lowercase p. Every letter makes a sound and p says p. Again, p. That's right. Friends, can you say one more time? Letter p. P, and what sound does it make? P. Say it with me. P. You got it. Oh, hi, Piggy Pig. Hi, Miss Monica. Do you know words that start with letter p? Yes. I know words that start with letter P. P. Penguin! Penguin starts with letter P. P. Penguin. That's right. Oh, I know another word that starts with letter P. Piano. P. Piano. Piano starts with letter P. Piano. It's an instrument. We can make music when we play the piano. Those are my two words. See you later, Miss Monica. Bye, friends. Oh, isn't it wonderful? Now we know words that start with letter P. P says P. Let's put it on the board. Here we go. Do, 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 do. And tap, tap, tap. Let's keep going to the other side of the board. Do, do, do. Shape of the day. What's our shape of the day? Hmm, let's take a look. Here it is. This is an oval. Can you say oval? Great, an oval reminds me of a circle, but it's just stretched out. It looks like a circle, but it's stretched out. That's right. The oval goes around this way. It curves around. Let's see if we can make an oval using our pointer finger. Can you put your pointer finger in the air? Let's start at the top. Okay, start at the top. We're going to do a curved line. Ready? We're going to curve around and then go back to the top. Curve up, 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 and stop. One more time. Start at the top, everyone. Take out your pointer fingers. We're pretending. Mm, let's pretend it's a marker. Okay, let's take our pointer fingers and draw our oval. Here we go. Curve around to the bottom and then curve around. Up, 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 up. And oval. Hmm, I was trying to think of things that are shaped like an oval. Oh, how about a football? Look at that. A football is shaped like an oval. Let's sing it. Oval, football, oval, football, oval, oval, oval. Again, oval, football, oval, Football, over, over, over. <laughs> oh, I think, hmm, there may be something.
something else shaped like an oval. How about an egg? Eggs look like ovals as well. Let's sing it. Oval, egg, oval, egg, oval, oval, oval. Oval, egg, oval, egg, oval, oval, oval. We did it. Great singing, everyone. Let's put our oval on the board. Here we go. Do, 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 do. And tap, tap, tap. Oh, let's make sure the oval's on there. Tap, 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 tap. The oval needs a few more taps. We did it. Here we go. Do, 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 do. Number of the day. What's our number of the day? Drum roll, please. Eight. Number eight. Eight is our number of the day. Can you count to number eight? Yay! Yes, let's do it together. Okay, you can point while you count. I'll point with the pointer. You can point with your pointer. Here we go. One, One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You did it. Great counting. Can you try that one more time? This time, I want you to try counting all by yourself. You can do it. Here we go. <gasps> you did it! Number eight. Oh, my friends, look at that. <gasps> there are peaches on the board. How many peaches can you count? Let's count together. I'm going to point with my pointer. You can count and point too. Here we go. One, One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight peaches. How many peaches did we count? Eight peaches. That's right. <laughs> oh, look at that. Paintbrush. How many paintbrushes can you count? Let's count together. Here we go. One, One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How many paintbrushes? Eight. There are eight paintbrushes. Yay! Great counting, everyone. And now it's time to put number eight on the board. Can you say one more time? Eight. You did it. Here we go. Do, 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 do. And tap, tap, tap. Number eight. Wow, look around. We completed our entire circle time board. And now it's time for our wiggle break. Hey kids, did you hear about my new dance? Hold the wiggle and shake. First, find your space, then wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Shake, 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 then jump. Then slide, then stomp, then hop. with me. Are you ready? Great. Here we go. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body. Let's jump in place. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body. Let's jump in place. Wiggle, wiggle. Jump, jump, jump. Wiggle, 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 wiggle, wiggle. Shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body. Let's slide in place. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body. Let's slide in place. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Slide. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Let's slide. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Slide. Wiggle, 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 let's slide. Wiggle, 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 shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body, let's stomp in place. Wiggle, 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 shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body, let's stomp in place. Wiggle, 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 stomp, stomp, stomp. Wiggle, 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 stomp, stomp, stomp. Wiggle, 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 
stomp, stomp, stomp. Wiggle, 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 stomp, stomp, stomp. Wiggle, 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 shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body, let's hop in place. Wiggle, 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 shake, shake, shake. It's time to move your body, let's hop in place. Wiggle, 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 hop, hop, hop. Wiggle, 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 hop, hop, hop. Wiggle, 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 hop, hop, hop. Wiggle, 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 all together now. Wiggle, 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 shake, shake, shake. Wiggle, 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 hop, hop, hop. Wiggle, 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 stomp, stomp, stomp. Wiggle, 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 slide and stop. Woo! That was so much fun. Oh, friends, guess what? It's time for us to go on our very special adventure so we can learn something new and we can even create our very own rocket ship. But first, we're going to head into our imaginary world. Are you ready? Oh, let's go on the count of three. One, two, three. Whoa, we made it into space. Now let's learn about Dr. Mae Jibison. She was the first black woman to travel into space aboard the space shuttle Endeavour. When she was a young girl, she loved looking up at the stars. She knew she wanted to go into space and she wanted to become a scientist and learn about the world. When she was older, she applied to become an astronaut. She studied really hard, and then guess what? She became an astronaut and traveled into space. Oh, look over there. Is that Dr. Mae Jemison? Everyone wave. Hello, Dr. Mae Jemison. Oh, it's so wonderful to meet you. And now it's time to create our very own rocket ship. That's right. I'm really excited about this. Okay, anytime we do a special craft, arts and craft project, we have to have materials. We need special materials so we can create our project. So let's find out what materials we need. First, we need paper. You can use construction paper or even cardstock. And then you're going to need a scissor, a pencil, glue, or tape. It's up to you. The real fun happens when we add the straw. So add any straw you like, okay? Let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is cut out some shapes. We need one oval. Now I cut different ones here so you can see that the ovals can be large, small, whatever you choose. If you see my rocket ship here, it's an oval. The main part of the rocket ship is an oval. So you have to cut out an oval. So today I'm going to use, do, 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 do. I'm going to use this oval. It's like an orange, orange oval. That's what I'm going to use. And then we need, look at this, one, two, two triangles. Those will be the wings of the rocket ship. I think I'm gonna use my blue triangles. I have one, two, and I'm gonna turn them this way. Two triangles. So these are the shapes we need. Two triangles, one oval, one rectangle. That's what we need to create our rocket ship. And then we'll use the straw a little later. Okay, first things first. You can decorate, color, or design your rocket ship any way you'd like. I like to just draw another oval inside to make it look like the window. And I draw a little line at the top and I draw a line at the bottom. And now I'm going to add my wings. So in order to add the wings, I'm just going to use my two triangles, one, two, and I'm going to stick them on the back of the triangle, excuse me, stick the wings on the back of the oval. So I turn my oval over, here's the back. And I'm going to use some glue for this one. You can use glue or tape, whatever you have. And you can use both for this project as well. So just add a little glue to the side of the rocket and then to the other side of the rocket. And then I add my triangle wing on top. Tap, tap, tap. And then on the other side, I do the same thing. Add my triangle wing on top. Tap, tap, tap. And now let's turn it over and see how it looks. <gasps> Whoa, it's coming along. I think I want mine to bend down a little bit like this. So I'm gonna turn it just a little. 
There's my rocket ship. Now, in order to make our rocket ship take off, blast off, we have to add the rectangle on the back of the rocket ship. So I'm going to turn it over again. I'm going to take my rectangle. Here's the rectangle shape. It's nice and wide. Now let's see, it's a little bigger. Uh, it's much bigger than my rocket ship, so I'm going to cut it just a little bit because I don't need it to be that big. Okay, there we go. We want it to be a little bit shorter. So adults, we want that rectangle to be a little bit shorter than the rocket ship, but you definitely need a good amount of room on both sides. So I'm going to bend one side up. Watch this. So one side of the rectangle, I'm going to bend up just like that and crease it. See how that looks? I bent it or folded it. You could say I folded it down and made a nice little crease here. Dun, dun, dun. And that's how that looks. Okay. I'm going to put some glue on that side. You can use glue or tape. I'm going to use both. So I'll show you how I'm using both. So first I'm putting some glue on that crease there that I folded and I'm going to glue that down and just hold it there for a little bit. Make sure it's stuck in place. I'll add a little tape later. And then I wanna do the same thing to the other side, but before I do that, I'm gonna bend this up a little bit because we need to make like almost like a little tunnel. You see that? It's straight and now I push it up just a little bit and it makes like a little tunnel. You see that? So now we have like a little tunnel. I have one finger on one side, one finger on the other. So it's the same thing as folding it over or making that little crease. Okay, same thing, and add glue on the other side. So you're pretty much doing the same thing on both sides, all right? And this time I'm going to use some tape. Tape because I really wanna make sure I secure it. So let's look to find the top of the rocket ship. Turn it around, here's the top of mine. So now that I know this is the top, I wanna to turn it back and I want to push the top of the rectangle down push it down, smush it, it doesn't have to look perfect. We just wanna close that part because now we're going to put our straw in really, really soon and we can't have any air seeping in. So I'm going to close it at the top. First, let me add some tape on the sides. This is just making sure it's secure. And then I'm gonna close it at the top. I'm just gonna smash it down just like that because we, we wanna make sure there's no air coming in. We have to close it so that way we can make our rocket ship blast off. The top of my rocket ship is all closed off and now it's time to add your straw. And this is going to help us do a very special blast off. Are you ready? So I'm going to go ahead and get my straw. I think I'm gonna use the pink straw for this one. Okay, so look at this. I'm gonna place this here so you can really see it, friends. See that? So turn it over, here's our tunnel here, and I'm going to put my straw right inside, and I'm not gonna push it all the way to the end, you can just push it right there, it's fine. But I think I need to close it a little more, I wanna make it secure so my straw fits right in there. Okay, I think that's perfect. And dun dun dun, let's test it. So my straw is right inside, I don't have to push it all the way in, I just put it just a little bit right there. And if it's not tight enough, if your straw keeps falling out, falling out, you just add some more tape or glue, depending on what you're using, just squeeze that rectangle a little more and you can make it a little tighter, okay? You can make it your tunnel a little bit tighter. And then try again. I'm ready. Get my hands ready. Are you ready to blast off again? Let's do it. Let's pretend we are just like Dr. May Jemison and we're going to travel into space. We have to take our rocket ships and blast off into space. Here we go. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard my rocket ship. Get your rocket ship and fly. Four. Count down. Three. Two. Get ready. One. Blast off. Yes! We did it. That was so much fun. 
Oh, my friends, I hope you had fun. Did you have fun? Wonderful. Oh, and don't forget, adults, if you are on social media, make sure you share these pictures or videos with me. I'd love to see your rocket ships. You can find me at Instagram at Monica J. Sutton or even on TikTok at Monica J. Sutton. Can't wait to see. Oh, friends, I hope you had an amazing time today here at Circle Time. It's time for us to say goodbye, but I will see you all again soon. Goodbye, everyone. I'll see you again soon. Bye, friends. Circle Time makes learning fun. Circle Time makes learning fun. Circle Time makes learning fun. Come sing and dance.